Hey Bean Boys, and welcome to yet another top 10 video. So a while back, I did a video about the most played animal in Animal Jam. In fact, so long ago that you can look at the quality and the animal I'm using in this video and realize just how long ago this was. Anyways, I randomly stumbled across that video again and realized I never talked about the least played animals in that video. Having spent so much time compiling so much data, as you can see me doing in the background, I felt like it'd be a waste to just leave the data where it was. There's so much more left to be discovered, so today I'm going to give you the top 10 least played animals. This is based on real data and why exactly they are played so little. Alright, keep in mind that this is number 10, so it's the most played of the least played. Anyways, that would be the panda. There are a few reasons why the panda just isn't that played, and some of those reasons actually contributed to it being played. I know that's weird, let me explain. So the first reason it's not really played is spikes and a lot of very popular items look really, really bad on him. The second reason they're not really played that also contributes to them being played is that everything looks weird on them. They're just, they have such a weird body type that everything you put on them ends up looking really strange, and so people like to make really, really funny looks, as I had a lot of fun doing in the background here. They don't legitimately get played, but for funny looks, they're great. Number 9 is the koala. Probably not too surprising. It's that animal you see every once in a while, but very rarely. Again, spikes look terrible on them. Absolutely terrible. But they're still super classy animals. Look at the fedora and the sneakers on this thing. I mean, honestly, you put a tux on it, you can actually make some very elegant looking looks. However, it shares a problem similar to many of the other unpopular animals, which is that the items that look really, really good on it and complement it well are the items that are less played and aren't super rare. Another thing that really hurts the koala is that other than the wolf, lots of non-member animals have kind of an unspoken veil around them as kind of like newbie bad animals because usually Animal Jam gives worse content to non-members. So when an animal is a non-member animal, people immediately assume that it's worse than the other ones. Number 8 is the lion, and it's for a reason you may not have totally thought about. Lions are super cool. When they were gift card only, they were very popular. You know, you got your king of the jungle, you dressed it up. It was awesome to have a lion. They're a cool looking animal. But the problem is, they cost 10 diamonds. And so do things like arctic wolves, and snow leopards, and arctic foxes, and animals that are generally accepted as cooler. And not everyone has unlimited diamonds. I mean, people are very conservative with their diamonds because they get one a week. So people are going to choose to spend their diamonds on the arctic wolves rather than the lion. Now, when I made this video, like I said, it was a long time ago, so some of this data is outdated and I've compensated for that. For example, drafts used to be very, very unpopular, but nowadays, they're for all jammers. Non-members love them. They're a nice, cool animal to switch into because you have limited choices, so they've gotten to be very popular. Instead, we default to the cheetah. There are a couple problems with the cheetah. First of all, a lot of common items don't look good on them, and the common items that do look good on them? Well, the snow leopard just wears them better. They have some cool actions, and they do a lot of cool stuff. They look really manly, and, like they sit, and they look awesome, but... They're just kind of like a slimmed down version of the snow leopard. And I mean, yeah, they're super cool and all, but the snow leopards are super cool. I think that's the real problem. People are always going to opt to choose a snow leopard over a cheetah. And so far, people have already opted to choose other animals, even over a snow leopard. So cheetahs are really falling to the bottom of the pack. Number six should come as no surprise to anyone, the monkeys. They're just not very popular. It's really hard to make cool looks with them because they have such a weird body type. And again, spikes look wretched on them and a lot of items are really misshapen. What's important to a lot of players is consistency. That's why Arctic Wolves are so popular is almost every item looks good on them. You can make a ton of different looks. Whereas with the monkey, it's really hard to make a good look. Look at how spikes look on him. He looks terrible. Number five is the otter. I actually didn't have an otter before this video, and after trying one out, they're awesome. Like, have you guys seen how they move? Honestly, like, people don't play them anymore, so I feel like we've all forgotten, but I forgot how hilarious they are. And everything looks so good on them, honestly. I'm shocked that they don't get played more. Number four is, unfortunately, my favorite. The horses, my main look and my pride and joy. I love playing one of the lesser played animals, but it does make me sad that fewer people play them. I mean, honestly, everything looks good on them. It's just kind of a fact. I tried to make the worst look possible, and then I ended up just making a hilarious looking party look. Look at this thing. Look at that. Number three is unfortunately the raccoons. I remember when they first came out and everyone was so psyched about them. I made a video showing off like every single cool item on them and all their emotes and everything. But nowadays they've kind of been forgotten. Because again, it's not like they're like monkeys or pandas. I mean, they're pretty cool animals, but that's the problem. They're pretty cool. They're always gonna get trumped by the ones that everyone's playing that look really cool. So that's why nobody really plays raccoons anymore. They're further hurt by the fact that once again, spikes look terrible on them and spikes are a pretty big deal in Animal Jam, if you haven't noticed. 
Number two is the kangaroo. Oh man, this poor little thing. Nobody plays it. They were kind of popular for a little bit when they came out, but even still, it's so hard to make a cool look with them, and all the looks that you try to make just kind of look like joke looks. So it's really difficult to play this seriously, and if you're going to make a joke animal, you might as well play something like a panda. And yes, this whole time I've been saying that spikes look bad on animals, but on kangaroos, they look absolutely horrible. Another really popular item is the tail armor, but for some reason on the kangaroo, when you sit still, the tail armor just becomes a rock and just sits there, and it looks really awkward. And the number one least played animal in Animal Gym is the elephant. Unfortunately, the elephants just aren't that cool. They have a lot of weird aspects, like wings look really small, spikes go in their trunk, which is cool, but logic, and tail armor is egregiously bad. I mentioned before the concept of consistency. This is a difficult one for Animal Gym to fulfill because when an animal isn't that popular, not that many people are playing it and there's not that much incentive to make an item look really cool on it. So over time, the items really just stop looking cool on some of the less popular animals and they really aren't as consistent as things like the Arctic Wolves because Animal Jam puts a lot of effort into every single time that they make an item for the Arctic Wolf. And that's why when you put an item on an Arctic Wolf, generally it's gonna look really, really cool. So if they could do something like this for every animal, who knows what would happen, but that's asking a lot of them. For now, Beans, go ahead and give some of these lesser played animals a try. You'll find some really unique looks and some stuff nobody's really figured out before. I had a ton of fun making outfits for this video, and actually my main look, the horse, the reason I changed to it is because I did that most played animal video and realized how underappreciated horses were. So I went and threw together a horse look in five minutes and thought it was really, really good, and now it's my main look. So go ahead and try something like that. You may find something you love. Arctic wolves aren't the solution.